Hello guys, it's me Jimmy. So the question is that I saw your video which is very nice and great. I like to know that I was working in a company called OK in Hyderabad Technical Sport. I need your suggestion to build my career career for my future. Where salary is very low, okay, with the main question is six and I and Okay, there's a dude from India. He was working in a Hyderabad company as a technical sport for the client. So he said the salary is very low, but he does not tell me which kind of degree he has. So here's what one thing. Everybody know computer support technicians are dying. Not only that, even IT engineers are fading out. That is the reality. The writing is on the wall. If you do not agree, then again, it's your personal opinion. This is my personal opinion. I can be totally wrong. You don't have to agree with me. Number one, people are going to vanish our support technician. Number two, IT engineer. And finally, sys admin. This admin will take at least 10 years before we uh, we we start seeing them feeding out. I will be telling you try to get into a data center as a I server technician. Server technician. Yes, a specific server technician. Your job will be more not likely technical. Your job will be building server for the client in a data in a how to say in a web hosting company or a data center like a one U or two U rack server you need to build for a client and they do all of the paperwork you need to it's mostly like you will be dealing client I mean you will be like in sales but also you will be getting your hands on on a in a server room also I'll be telling you to do that because that is one of the best advice I can give you try to get into I mean if you have some money I will be telling you to get the uh, Compia server plus certificate which a lot of people don't want to talk we still hold a lot of value even if even someone is going to hire you you are going to learn a lot about server and then if you can get the MCSE try to go for the MCSE in Windows Server 10 I hope this answers the question and then yeah I mean that's more than enough if you are going to get this main two certificate the server plus Compia server plus and the MCSE currently at the time of recording there is no MCSE Windows Server days MCSA even you can't get a MCSE you just get a MCSA which require three exam when they will be like optional I mean two more exam will be available and then you can go and take the MCSE because you take the MCSA right now for a three exam and then you take the extra two exam uh, which fulfill the requirement for the MCSE and you will be given the MCSE certificate. MCSE stands for Microsoft Certified Solution Expert before I mean few years back it stands for Microsoft Certified System Engineer. Yeah I mean try to get into a data center I mean trying to work as I, I'm not going to call a server technician. I mean the job title can be I mean uh, can be like I mean change I mean from one thing you can be like uh, how to say like an e-commerce or like a consultant I mean whatever your main job will be selling a client like for uh, I mean a lot of I mean small businesses they require their personal data center I mean in a in a data center company so you your your job will be like I mean telling what is the difference between one you how many gigabyte they need how many uh, amount of RAM they need, which kind of VM processor they need, how many threads they need, that kind of paperwork after that done, go back to the server room, put the one you two you rack, how many you you wanna put, just put it, I mean, that will be the job, I hope this answers the question, it was me or Jimmy Eric, bye, check out the links in the description box below, never stop learning, never stop learning, keep going on.